I'll just add new item. I'll add one more report. And this time from toolbox, instead of taking matrix matrix report, I'll take chart. Now, what is it I want this time? On x-axis, whatever the information you want, you need to drop that column on the right. I'll just take department name and drop it here. And I'll take number of employees data, I'll drop it here. Save this. Add new item, select work form, add toolbox, go for the report viewer control. I'll select this report that I have added just now. Execute this. This time I should get a graphical report. Now you can see this is a graphical report which says that in department database you have so many employees. This uh, represent department database, this represent education, this color represent some department and this color represent RR. And Y axis represents number of employees. I'll go for this graphical report back. Now, drop category field here. Now, this time I'll drop employee gender in category field. Save this. For this default to page and execute. Now you can see that female category and male category. I have so many number of female employees which belongs to so and so department and so many number of male employees which belongs to so and so department. So this kind of graphical reports I can develop with the help of client side reports SSRS. I'll go back, I'll select this report, right click, I'll say chart type instead of columns this time I'll go for pie chart simple pie chart save this execute it sorry default execute this So you get the pie chart and here the color says what department and what employee. Just go for the properties, 3D effects, display 3D charts, say ok. Now you will see the effect of 3D property. Now this becomes my 3D report. In the same way, you can right click and chart type, you can go for chart, instead of pie chart you can go for, uh, so I will just go for bar chart. which is a 3D bar. So you have n number of options, you can use them to display beautiful graphical reports. Each color represents each department. Thank you very much.